Last year's American League Rookie of the Year calls Seattle home, and the favorite to win this year's National League Rookie of the Year used to call Seattle home. Seattle native and former Lakeside star Corbin Carroll is set to start on opening day for the Arizona Diamondbacks. He tells me the memories of his decorated high school career stick with him, an origin story that now fuels the top prospect in all of baseball. I'm not sure how tall I was, probably 5'6", five, 5'7". Five, Probably weighed like 130 pounds. The year was 2016 and a 15 year old Corbin Carroll hadn't hit his growth spurt yet. He still stood mighty tall in the batter's box. Carroll's varsity coach Kellen Sundin remembers him as a force, even as a freshman. He batted leadoff and played in the outfield from day one. Carroll led Lakeside to the state championship game in his first year of high school baseball and then to three more years of unprecedented success. All four of the teams he played in high school were the four strongest teams we ever had at the school. Corbin hit 450 for his high school career, 540 as a senior, but it still seemed like some scouts were worried about different numbers. I remember a couple scouts bringing a scale to the dugout after games to weigh in. I just want to go out there and let my game speak for itself. Corbin said instead of it igniting a fire, he ignored it. I'm focused on my craft and, and being the best player I can be, and I feel like other people's uh, perceptions don't really tie into that. In 2019, the Diamondbacks selected Carroll with their first round pick the first high school first rounder from Washington since 2013. He was on a fast track to the big leagues until 2021 when he tore his labrum while hitting a home run. Yet again, Carroll faced his critics. Can I become what I was before? And, and as I went along, I just, I found that that was not, not a very healthy way to think, right? And yet again, he came out on top. I set the goal of, of coming back a better player. Carroll made his big league debut at the end of last year and is now the top prospect in baseball. He enters the new season with the same approach. In my mind, I've always liked kind of that underdog mentality, uh, chip on the shoulder, but just having some, some gratefulness for that, the fact that, that people see me in, in that light. Corbin will get to face his hometown Mariners in Arizona at the end of July. He's just like the rest of us. He said his favorite player is Julio, and he can't wait to play against him. In Scottsdale, Jake Garcia, King 5 Sports.